everyone welcome to spiritual butterfly today i will be doing a reading for aquarius we are going to look at what is going out and what is coming in this is a timeless reading so whenever you click on this video that is when these messages could be meant for you remember that this is general so everything is not going to resonate just take what does apply it and leave the rest also, Aquarius, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you are not already, and click the notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So let's jump right into it and look at what is going out for you. So Spirit, what is going out for Aquarius? Okay, I have infinity, seek clarity, and I have competition, some courage, and self-confidence. Nobody puts baby in the corner. <laughs> Aquarius, you're getting ready like to come out. I feel like for some of you, you may have felt suppressed um, when it comes to your pursuits, the things that you really want to do in your life. Um, you really lack clarity. You really didn't know which direction that you wanted to take. Um, and it's like you're finally, I heard like coming together. You're finally getting that epiphany. You're finally getting that aha moment as to what it is that you want to do. For some of you, I heard school. You may be going to school. I'm trying to pick a major in college. Um, for others of you, I get relationships. Like this is surrounding a connection. Um, it's like I heard back and forth. You and this person may have been going back and forth. You may live at a distance from this person. Um, I heard move in together. You and this person may have discussed moving in together. And it's like you just really don't know. It's like you lean one way one day. And then the next day, it's like you're leaning in the opposite direction. So it's like you really don't know what to do. I heard like I got my mind made up. So it's like your mind really isn't made up as to how you want to proceed when it comes to um, this relationship. I also heard career for some of you. Um, you're having difficulty when it comes to your career. I heard career change. You may be thinking about changing your career. And again, I heard like changing your major. I feel like with this competition, for some of you, this has to do like with your career. I get like a heavy feeling when it comes to career. Some of you, um, I heard like job. I heard like promotion. Like you normally would sit in the back and just let other people you know take the center stage but this is you really being more of a go-getter really putting yourself out there really putting your ideals out there not being afraid of competition not being afraid of you know having to compete for the things that you want the things that you desire in life this is you just really being confident in your pursuits confident in your skills and your abilities i heard like the perfect match um i heard you're not afraid to go after what you want and spirit says especially when it comes to love so for some of you i feel like you're going to be putting yourself out there more when it comes to relationships connections you may be dating more um you just may be really owning your true self and not being afraid to show people who you are um some of you i heard like friendly you may come off as being more friendly you may be more talkative um, you may just be more inviting to people. So let's get a message for what's going, what's coming in. I have resilience, rise above tribulations, and I have dragon, discover your courage. So yeah, Aquarius, with competition, self-confidence, rise above tribulation, resilience, and discover your courage. Like this is just really about you taking center stage, like really owning who you are, um, not being afraid of a challenge, not being afraid to go after what you want. For some of you, like I said, this is about your career. For others of you, this is about your love life relationship. It's like you're no longer caring about how other people feel when it comes to your life. Like you don't care. You're doing what makes you happy. You're doing what brings you fulfillment. I heard like don't agree. For some of you, there's people around you who may not agree with your relationship, who may not agree with who you are choosing to be in a connection with. But it's like, no, I'm doing what brings me joy, what is going to make me feel complete. 
and I'm no longer caring about what other people think, how other people feel. This is me making decisions for myself, making the best decisions that I feel for my life and no longer allowing other people's opinion to sway me. So this is just you just taking hold of life and being confident and finally knowing what you want to do. Everything finally becoming clear to you so that you can move forward and have that life that you desire, Aquarius. So let's clarify these messages to go a little deeper. Spirit, tell me about Anthony. Oh, Aquarius, come on. The star. This is your energy. You are in your power fully. You are owning it. Like, you know what you want to do, how you want to do it, how you want to get there, how it's going to work. It's like, again, I heard like seeking the opinions of others. You're no longer going to be waiting for other people to decide for you or to influence you to think one way or to do something. It's like, no, you're going to be stepping out on the limb and making that decision for yourself. It's like, you're not going to wait for other people's approval. No, this is you saying, I approve of myself. I don't need you to approve of me. I don't need you to approve of my lifestyle. I don't need you to approve of my relationship. I don't need you to approve of the career that I choose to go into. No, I know what is best for me. I'm trusting myself. This is you trusting your instinct. This is you trusting your to intuition, trusting your gut feeling and no longer allowing other people to have that hold on you when it comes to your decisions, Aquarius. Yes, yeah, seek clarity. Spirit says like light, follow the light. This is you finally gaining that insight that you need when it comes to the direction you need to move in. Again, relationship and career. For some of you. Let's get a message for the star. Come on, Aquarius. Two of swords in reverse. You know what you want to do. You know what you want to do and you're doing it. You're no longer allowing people. I heard like to talk you out of it. You're no longer allowing people to talk you out of what you want. <laughs> this is you saying, forget about you. I know what I want and I'm going to do it. I don't care what you think. I don't care how you feel. I no longer need your insight. I know what's best for me. Let's get a message for competition. Okay, oh, I have the nine of pentacles and I have the empress in the reverse competition. Yes, there's people around you who do not want to see you succeed, who do not want to see you be successful, who do not want to see you be financially independent. They want to stop you. They want to block you. But this is you saying, no, I'm going for that promotion. I'm not letting you stop me. I'm going to start that business. I'm going to start that YouTube channel. I'm going to start that Instagram channel or Instagram page. I'm going to do what it is that I feel I'm being called to do. I'm being led to do. This is you no longer holding yourself back. This is you choosing to grow despite what comes up against you. Despite who tries to block you. This is you saying, no, I'm moving towards my nine of pentacles. Yeah, there are people who don't want to see you make it. Who don't want to see you be in your energy of the empress. There's people around you who feel like the only way they're going to be able to succeed, Aquarius, is if they stop you, if they put up blockages for you. That's the only way they feel like they're going to be able to be successful because they see you as competition. They see you as competition. I heard promotion. For someone, you're going to be going up for a job promotion. And this person feels like the only way they're going to get to their nine of pentacles is if they stop you. Is if they put in a bad word for you. They don't want to see you elevate. This is how this person feels like they're going to get ahead. But I heard you being unapologetically you. But it, Spirit says you're up for the challenge. You're going to be unapologetic 
about the things that you go after. You don't care about who toes you have to step on to get to the next level. This is going to be you moving forward, full speed ahead and being prepared for any competition that comes your way, for any strife that comes your way. Spirit, clarify this nine of pentacles. Come on, the fool. This is you taking that leap of faith and saying, hey, whatever competition is out there, there's more than enough room for me. And I'm going to do it. This is you saying, I'm just going to do it. Forget about <laughs> who else is going to be going up for, I heard like that role. For someone like you may be trying to be in the entertainment industry. You may be trying to be an actor or actress. It's like, you're saying, forget about it. I'm not going to worry about the next person. I'm going to focus on me. I'm doing this for me. I'm just, I'm stepping out on the limb. I'm doing it. I'm not talking myself out of it. And whatever is for me is meant for me. Let's get a message for the Empress. I have the Queen of Swords in the reverse. And I have the Four of Cups in the reverse. I feel I heard doubt. For some of you, you have people in your energy who try to put doubt in your mind. They try to put doubt in your mind. Because they don't want you to accept this new beginning. They don't want you to accept this offer. They don't want you to go after this new opportunity. They want you to miss out. They want you to miss the moment. They want you to miss this blessing. They want you to miss out on this opportunity that spirit is giving you. I heard like miss the bus. Yeah, they want you to miss the bus. They don't want you to go forward. So they're trying to create blockages when it comes to your confidence. Seek clarity, yes. You have people who's trying to really play with your your mind, um, try to create doubt within you, trying to make you doubt yourself, um, trying to get you not to really trust your intuition, Aquarius. They want you to miss out on this. They want you to miss out on this opportunity so that you don't go anywhere, so that you remain stuck. I'm also getting dance. For some of you, you may um, be a dancer. You may be going... Um, up against someone when it comes to some type of um, dance role or um, a dance competition I'm getting yeah her arts for someone like you're in in the arts actress dancing and it's like you have to compete with a lot of people and so you have people around you who may try to do things or say things to really mess with your confidence but it's like no no it's not gonna happen this is you saying, no, I'm going to seize this moment regardless of what comes up against me. I'm going to seize this opportunity. Despite my fears, despite the questions that I may have within myself about my own abilities, I'm going to do this regardless. Let's get a message for resilience. I have the Page of Cups and I have the Nine of Wands. You're not giving up. You're not giving up at all. This is you not giving up when it comes to this new opportunity. You're not giving up. This is for some of you, her dream. This is something that you've always wanted to do. Ever since you was a child, you've wanted to do this. And it's like, I heard I'm not giving up now. Like you've come this far, Aquarius, you're not giving up now. And I heard business, for some of you, this is about you starting your own business. You're not giving up now. You've had this dream for so long that it's like you've come too far to walk away. You put in too much work, too much effort, too much time to walk away from this. Spirit, give me a message for the Page of Cups. For some of you, this is a relationship. You're like, no, I, I've been <laughs> with this person for too long. We've been through too much. We've come too far. I'm not giving up on this person. I'm not giving up on this relationship. Spirit, tell me about this Page of Cups. Look, nine of swords in the reverse. Yeah. You're not giving up on this. It's like you've been through the worst. I've already been through the worst. 
I've been through the heartache, the pain, the disappointment. I've been there. I've done that. I've moved beyond that. And I'm standing up for what I believe in. I'm standing up for what I want. And I'm not backing down. I'm going to keep pushing forward until I get where I want to be. Let's get a message for the Nine of Wands. I have the Eight of Swords in the reverse. When I say this is about you completely coming out of your mind, coming out of self-doubt, coming out of negative self-talk and being like, hey, no, I'm going, I'm going forward. Ain't nothing to it but to do it and I'm doing it. Like this is you no longer being stuck, being stuck in your thoughts, being stuck in your head, having any type of doubt. This is just you pushing forward at all costs. Let's get a message for Dragon. Discover your courage. This is you overcoming self. That's what Spirit says, Aquarius. For a lot of you, you're overcoming self. You're overcoming your own thoughts. For some of you, you were your own worst enemy. And it's like you're just overcoming self. That's what you're doing. That's what this next season, this next chapter is going to be about for you. Overcoming self. So it's like what's going out is the self-doubt, the negative self-talk. Letting people influence you. To not take risk, to not follow your dreams, to not push forward. This is you saying, I have to own my own life. I have to own my own destiny. Okay, ooh, the Knight of Pentacles. Discover your courage. You're going after it. You're going after it. Whether this is about a relationship, whether this is about... For some of you, you're thinking about moving to be closer to this person. You're thinking about moving, relocating. But whether this is about a relationship, a job, you're starting your own business, you're going after it. You're not letting anything stop you. You're being courageous. You're embracing change. Yes. And I heard you're not being modest about it either. You're being bold. And this season, you're being bold, Aquarius. Spirit, tell me about the Knight of Pentacles. The devil in the reverse. Yes. You're going after it. <sighs> so many people have tried to put stumbling blocks in your way, Aquarius. For some of you, this is family, toxic family members, toxic friends, yourself, you being your own worst enemy. Just putting stumbling blocks after stumbling blocks in your way so that you don't move forward. But this is you overcoming it all. All of the challenges, all of the difficulties. All of the toxicity and moving on to bigger and better. Yes, I'm back and I'm better. Yes, Aquarius. Returning back to yourself, but a higher version of yourself, a better version of yourself. One that is confident, one that is really sure of the actions, the directions that you're taking. The things that you're seeking after, the things that you want. Yes, you're overcoming it all, Aquarius overcoming it all for some of you i heard addiction you're overcoming addiction what's going out is you no longer dealing with any addictive behaviors any toxic behaviors it's like you're truly becoming one with yourself you're choosing to embrace opportunities things that's going to really help you grow that Things that are going to help you become stable. And it's like once you release this devil energy, whether this is you, whether this is family, whether this is friends for some of you, whether this is a relationship, that is when these opportunities are going to start to pour in. But you have to clear out this negative energy. You have to clear out the negative residue in order for these opportunities to come in. Look, and it's following him. Look at the pinnacles. The pinnacles are following him. He's not chasing the pinnacles. They are following him. 
They're chasing after him. So yes, your dreams are going to chase you, Aquarius, once you release and let go. That's what's coming in. Your dreams are going to start to chase you. They're going to start calling you. New opportunities. Doors are getting ready to open. They will chase you. They will follow after you. Yes, because you're letting go. You're releasing and making room for these opportunities. So now they're free to flow, free flowing. Yes, your opportunities are going to be free flowing. They're going to be flowing after you. So let's pull some final messages. So spirit, what final messages do you have for Aquarius? Final message for Aquarius. Look at what I have. Wolf spirit, turn knowledge into wisdom. Yes. Everything that you have learned, this has been about a learning journey, a journey of growth. Yes, everything that you have learned, you have experienced, turn it into wisdom. Let it make you wiser when it comes to the decisions you're making for your life. Yes, owning who you are, owning your choices, choosing to be better, choosing to do better. Let's pull one more message. Spirit, give me one more message for Aquarius. One more message. Brown bear spirit, take time out. Yes, take time away. For some of you, I heard relationships. I see you pulling back your energy from a lot of relationships, family relationships, friendships. For some of you, you're going to be pulling back your energy from a connection. But it's like you're pulling back your energy from things that no longer serve you. From things that were toxic to your being. That was toxic to your growth. So it's like take a time out. Spirit is saying it's okay to pull back. It's okay to pull back your energy. It's okay to go into hermit mode and to have time for yourself to reflect. It's like yes. Always take time for you. And always do what's best for you Aquarius. Even if it means you having to let people go. You having to cut people off in order to maintain your peace in order to maintain your sanity and move forward in the direction you want to go so aquarius these are your messages i hope they resonate stay true to thyself and real with thyself grow with me as i grow with you everyone stay blessed